Your radio is on channel mode. Channel mode. And you're going to want to hold down the scan button. Scanning begin. Engine 78, we're working on the engines first, then we're going to call. Los Angeles, it's a female run over Brown 56178. What you see is channels going by very quickly. This is the radio listening very briefly to each channel, and if it hears anyone talking, then it'll pause on that channel. If your radio is set primarily for fire scenes, you're going to be scanning Blue 8, Forest Net, and probably TAC 2. If you hand program in other frequencies, those frequencies will also scan as well. If your radio is set up for disaster use, your radio will be set up to scan LA County Fire Dispatch, uh, LA County Fire Command Frequencies, Sheriff's Dispatch Frequencies, and National Calling Frequencies, which is about 30 frequencies altogether. Now your Bofeng is not designed to be a scanner, and what that means is it'll scan slowly, and to go through 30 channels it'll take about 7 seconds, which means you could miss uh, quite a bit of radio traffic on any given channel. One of the ideas behind scanning is you can get is you can get an idea who is uh, talking on what frequencies around you and it can allow you to determine which frequencies you want to pay closer attention to and then from there you can come off scan mode and you can uh, choose two frequencies that you want to listen to one on A and one on B pressing exit will exit you from scan mode now to get into the settings for search you're gonna press menu We'll first confirm you're not scanning. And I'm going to go to a quiet frequency just so I'm not distracted. To get into the scanning options, press menu, press 1-8, and you'll see it says SCREV. Now there's three settings. There's TO, which stands for timeout. If you press menu again, you can scroll through to SE, which is search and CO which is continuous. So with your timeout setting which is what this radio was set to if you noticed it would listen for about five seconds and then it would keep scanning so it doesn't get locked down on any any one frequency. This is my preferred setting. This radio I just realized seems to listen for about five seconds. There's probably a way to change that in the software. Uh, the other radios I have listen for about 10 seconds. Now the CO setting, what that will do is the CO setting will stay on the frequency as long as it hears radio traffic. So if somebody has a 60 second or a two minute broadcast, then it'll stay on that frequency that entire time before continuing once that traffic drops off. The search function allows you to scan and the first channel that it hears radio traffic on, it'll stop on that channel and it will no longer scan. I was going to go through and talk about my default settings, but I can't do it without talking about each one, which is going to take a little bit of time. So I'm going to save that for another video. The next video is important. We're going to talk about why other people can't hear you when you're trying to talk to them when you're trying to transmit. There's a number of reasons for that and we are going to talk about that including uh, tone guards, uh, power settings, antennas, line of sight, and repeaters.